Hey, what's up? Um, this trick, the car manipulation, is going to be a very difficult trick to perform. It takes a lot of practice and it takes a lot of preparation. Now, what you start out with is that the whole deck is in order. All the deck is here apart from the ace through five of spades. And the way I order it is that it's spades to diamonds to clubs to hearts. That's how I do it. You can do spades red, clubs red. It just looks better with spades. You can use any of the card, any of the suits you want first. It doesn't really matter. Now what you do is that you start out by spreading these cards out like this. You take these cards right here. And basically you try to focus on these five cards right here. You make it seem like these are the only cards that you're going to find and the whole deck is shuffled. Then you give people the illusion that this deck is shuffled, but it's actually not. Show the first card, the ace of spades, you put that on the middle. Um, in the middle right there, you get the two of spades, put it to the right of it. Three of spades, put it to the left of it. The four of spades, all the way to the right. Five of spades, all the way to the left. Now the point of this is basically to give the illusion that these cards are going to shuffle into the deck. When really they're not, it's just something weird. And what you do is you break them together just like that. And what happens is that these five cards end up on the top of the deck in this order. In five, two, ace, or five, three, ace, two, and four on the top of the deck. And then what I do, what Ricky J does, is that you make it seem like you're taking a chunk off the top of the deck. But what, we're really, what, he, what we really do is we take three cards, one, two, three, like this. And what you do is you take, put it like that. If you do it fast enough, it looks like a chunk. It really is only three cards. One, two, three. Just like that. It's on the bottom now. And at this point, you can do a false shuffle, which goes like this. You take half the cards from the top, from the bottom. You go one, two, three, four, five. Five cards. Put this down. And take this chunk right here and do the same thing. You go one, two, three, four, five. Then you put this back. You do that fast enough, it looks like an actual shuffle. And then what you do right here is this, like that. You throw the deck and hold on to two cards. What you're doing is you're getting these ace and two of spades. You take from the bottom and from the top. You put, you throw it and you just, it slides. Just like this, like that, and it slides off just like that. If you hold on to them, if you do it quick, it really looks good, you know. So this ace comes from the bottom, start from the bottom now. Yeah, okay. Uh, <laughs> and you put these two down just like that. Now at this point, you do a swivel cut where you take half of the top of the deck, hold it like this, and you slide it out, and then you take your thumb and you push off. The bottom card and put it on top just like that and then you hold a break as you put the pack down so that you can hold the break just like that and you take this three you put it down you're going to use this again so don't forget about it you take that pile that you're holding a break from put it down put this on top then take this three right here now what ricky j does and i I'm, i can't do this for some reason you take the pack you split it and as you're splitting it, you throw the stuff and you catch it. See, I messed up already. <laughs> so you can try to do that. You know, what I do is that I split the deck just like this. I it's called a it's it's a it's a it's a shuffle. It's a one-handed shuffle. The one-handed cut, you drop cards, push it up, and as you put it as this is falling, you put the three of spades in there. Then you spread it out, and you take this pack over here, bring it over here, put this pack over there. And then take this three, put it down, and the bottom card is going to be a four of spades, and the top card is going to be a five of spades. You take this pile, put it on top, just like that. And now the deck is still in order. And at this point, basically, you found the five original cards. But you do want to keep going, and it makes it look cooler. Now you do another fall shuffle, the same thing that I was doing before, where you take half the cards from the bottom, put one, two, three, four, five, put this down. Take this, go one, two, three, four, five. Put this back. And then you do another swivel, another swivel cut. And you take off the top card like this, do like that, go like that. 
And then you make a you catch a break again. And then you look at it, show these, make them forget about the cards, and then you take from that break, put it down onto the table, put this on there, and then take off the next card. Eight of spades. And then you do this other thing. This is a little difficult to make look good. You take like you're gonna take off the uh the bottom pile, like you're gonna drag it out. It's supposed to look like this and then like this, but what you're doing is that you're taking like like that, but then you quickly grab like that, the top card, the top um, pile like this, and then you put this down, and then you put that down just like that, and take off this card. So so it looks like this came from the middle, but actually it came from the top, not a spade. So put that right there. You take this pile, put this on here just like that. You take this, put it on here. And you catch a break. It's like you gotta get flesh under there, just like that. Then you bring it over here, keep that flesh, and then you grab the bottom pile, put that on the top, and then grab the next card, which is a ten of spades. Now this part right here is really cool. It's also kind of difficult too. You kind of you gotta slide. Well, you'll see. Let me just show you real quick. What you gotta try to do is get the top card. It's always gonna be the top card with this figure right here by split you'll see let me just show you real quick so you go just gotta prepare for it a little bit then you go like that and here it goes the jack of spades let me show you again slow motion uh... let's say i would take off a pack like this and i would slide out this so like so it looks like it comes from the middle but it's not it's actually coming from the top you throw it like that then you put this back where it was and then you make it seem like it came from the middle And the next thing is you reveal the queen and the king at the same time. And the way you do it is that you want to do a false shuffle right here. This is a, um, you basically cut the cards three times. And it looks like you're just cutting them, but actually it's a false shuffle. Let me show you real quick. So, sorry, this cloth on it is kind of loose. But it's a false shuffle. What you do is you take part of the cards from the bottom, put it down, and then you get a cut, uh, break right there. Not that big, smaller than that, but I'm trying to exaggerate it so you can see. Then you grab some more cards from the bottom, from the bottom like this, and you put that on top of those cards. And you don't have to close the break, you just put that on top. Then you grab the rest of it from that break and put that on top. And if you do it fast enough, it looks like a pretty decent shuffle. And then you do a thing called a slip cut, which is basically like what you did with the jacks. You're not going to throw the queen this time, you're going to slide it off. Take off the bottom pile and slide off the queen like this. Put them down and then show them. Let me show you it fast so that way you'll see what it looks like. So you go like that. Queen. Okay. Over time so you can see it. I'm going to do it slow. So you do like, you can do whatever you want. Make it look like you're about to do something. Then you go, bam. Just like that. You show the queen. Put that down. Show the king. Put that down. Then put this pile on top, and at this point you can do whatever you want. Um, you're done finding all the aces, all the uh, all the spades. You can do any kind of false shuffle possible. Just keep this in order. You can do a false shuffle like this. I don't. Um, if you want to find out any new false shuffles, look them up online. I'm not going to really teach any except for the ones that I already did. And then after you do that for a little bit, you're satisfied. Then you say, "All right." Well, you don't say anything. You just show the cards like that. You show that they're all still in order. And that's the tutorial. That's it.